Hello YouTube and welcome to Bobsha Crafts. Today we are um, going to be cleaning and repairing and um, rewigging Samantha here. Okay, unfortunately Samantha had an accident. My niece put her in the dryer and her hair is pretty bad. It's, it's nothing but tangles. So we're going to go ahead and first restring her neck because I needed to take her head off since I need to shave her head and reroute it so I need to be able to come up from the bottom. So I just simply clipped the little plastic piece that was there. So what we're going to do is I'm just going to take some, some string and a drawstring threader and scissors and we are simply going to cut a string that will be long enough for her mom to be able to tie and untie so next time she needs to be washed or goes in the dryer um, it's just her body not her head. So we're going to go ahead and load our little drawstring thing here. So Put your thread up and through, up and through the top part, and I like to just wrap it through so I don't lose it somewhere in the middle. Take the bottom of the drawstring threader and put it through the fabric. You'll find the little hole where the drawstring or plastic piece initially was. and just put that through there okay this does not want to go through so we're going to try it the other way we'll put the string in first and push it through because this part's more flexible than the handle it's actually made to do drawstrings on sweatpants and such so obviously on adult pants or even children's clothes you have a lot more a lot more room. Almost there. Okay, now we just simply untie that and pull the string out and we'll pull our drawstring threader out. She has a new thread, so now when we get done and put her head on, we'll be able to tie that. And I just left the string long enough, so if it's too short, it's too hard to tie. Okay, so that's how you restring the doll's neck. Um, at this point, if the doll's lost any filling, you can also take some polyfill and just stuff it in there. Or if you need to tighten up her arm and leg joints, you just simply take out the polyfill and you can tighten those up right here to make sure they're nice and tight. Same thing with the legs. But at this point, it looks like her filling's good and her arms and legs are good. So that was the head. Next video, we'll be, um, we'll be working on her... Um, her skin care because we need to get a lot of these marks and dirty things off. So we'll do that next. Mm -hmm. 